Boys and girls, today we're going to be reading a story about <gasps> three bears, that's right. A story about Goldilocks and the three bears. Turn the pages. How do you think this story might start? How might it start? At the end. At the beginning. And what do you think it might say at the beginning of the story? there were three bears that lived in a house in the wood. Daddy bear was a very big, big bear. bear. Mammy bear was medium, medium size and baby bear was a little bear. Was a tiny bear. He was, he was just little. One morning mummy bear decided to make some porridge. So she got out three bowls. One bowl, two, and she made her porridge and she put it into three bowls but the porridge was too hot to eat so the bears decided to go for a walk in the woods and while the bears were on their walk a little girl came and she saw a house and what do you think this girl could be called goldilocks, goldilocks that's right and Goldilocks knocked on the door of the three bears' house and nobody was inside. So she opened the door and she had a little look. Shall we see what she could see on the table? Let's have a little look. Goldilocks saw the bears' porridge, the three bowls of porridge. And it smelled delicious and she thought, oh, I'm going to have a try of this porridge. So she had, she picked up the spoon. And she had a try of the porridge from the big bowl. Oh, whose bowl could that have been? Daddy, Daddy Bear's. Oh, it was, she didn't like it. It was too hot. It was too hot. So then she tried the next size bowl. Who do you think that could be? The medium size? Mammy. The medium size Mammy Bear's bowl. And she gave it a little try. Oh, no. It was too salty. She didn't like that. And then she tried the little bowl. Whose bowl was that? The, the baby tiny bear, can she give it a little taste? Oh, this is delicious, she thought. And she ate it all. So then she was, oh, she was feeling full. So she thought, oh, I'm going to go and have a little sit down. Oh, so off she goes and she went and she had a little sit down. And she saw three chairs and she sat on the big chair. Whose chair could that have been? Daddy, Daddy. Thanks, Daddy. Oh, it was too big was too big for her she thought oh this isn't very comfortable so she got off the big chair and she tried the next size the medium sized chair whose chair could the medium sized one have been mammy's. mammy's but oh it was too soft it was too soft it was too comfortable she says oh i'm not gonna sit on this one and then she tried the little chair whose chair was this baby. Oh, it was baby bear's chair that's right and do you know boys and girls oh guess what happened she was too big for it and it broke. Uh oh. So she got up off the chair and she thought, oh, what a very exciting time I'm having in this house. I think I'm going to need a lie down. So Goldilocks walked up the stairs and she found a really big bed. Daddy Bear's bed. And she climbed on. Oh, it took her a, a, a long time to climb on and she climbed on and she thought, oh, this bed's not very comfortable. It's too big and hard. So she and she went on to the next one and it was the medium sized bed whose bed mammy's bed oh she got on and oh it was too lumpy oh this isn't very comfortable so she tried the next size bed the little bed oh she climbed on there and it was just right and she fell asleep she fell asleep because it was so comfortable and while goldilocks was asleep who came home Three the three bears, bears and they'd been on a long walk and they were feeling very hungry <gasps> and they looked and daddy bear he said who's been eating my porridge and mommy bear said who's been eating my porridge <gasps> and baby bear looked very sad and he started crying and he said who's been eating my porridge it's my bowl's empty there's none left <gasps> and then Notice the chairs. They could see that somebody had been sitting on their chairs. Oh, they were 
board was I was feeling so sad. And Daddy Bear, he looked at his chair and he said, Who's been sitting on my chair? Daddy Bear looked at her chair and she said, Who's been sitting on my chair? And Daddy Bear, Oh no! <laughs> Look at my chair! It's broken! And Mammy Bear said, Baby Bear, don't feel sad. Have a little look upstairs. So they all walked upstairs, and Daddy Bear, oh, in his big voice, he said, "Who's been sleeping in my bed?" And Mummy Bear said in her medium sized voice, "Who's been sleeping in my bed?" And then Baby Bear, oh, he was very shocked. He went, oh, "Look, come and see. There's somebody asleep in my bed. Who could it be?" Goldilocks. It's Goldilocks. Bears all stood around the bed and watched Goldilocks. And then oh, she woke up with a fright and she saw the three bears. And quickly she ran down the stairs and out the door. And she didn't come back to the bear's house ever again. And that's what do you think might have happened now? What could have happened now, do you think? Goldilocks ran away. Girl, Goldilocks ran away. And guess what? The bears are still really hungry. So what might happen? They might get some more. <gasps> Mammy Bear might make some more porridge. Good idea. Mammy Bear's going to make some more porridge. And the bears are going to be all happy for the rest of the day with their tummies full. Mm. <gasps> oh, boys and girls, what a lovely story. Thank you for helping me tell the story.